Yo, what up? It's your man, LR. We um, go through this little tutorial on how to customize your own shirts on the GBA Shirt Shop. So here we are at the front page. First thing we're going to do, we go to Customize. Customize to open up. Now it currently has my last design up, which if you wish to use it, you can take your mouse, when you move the mouse over, you'll see it changes to that symbol where you can move it around. And if you notice when you move it around, you have these little lines that pop up. Those are center lines. So if you want something perfectly centered, it'll show you where to center it horizontally. All right, this is what you click to delete. This is if you want to make it bigger or smaller. If you want to rotate it. So. Ah, that gets rid of the center line. You know, that's bothering you or whatever. So. And then if you wish to, let's do it with something. So put it up there. Now, you can go to designs and you can find other designs that I have and add them to the picture. So say we want to add this after, click on it. Change the colors over here if you don't like the colors. And this is as far as arrangement, like if you have things stacked over each other, I can see that's over it. If I click send back, it's it behind it. To the front. That's kind of cool. So if you want to add text, you can click text. And simple all saying this is if you want it centered, if you want it left justified, right justified, italics, bold. Not just like a word processor. You can make the like smaller and bigger here. If you want to curve the text. That way, and that way, that. Of course, you can change the color here. All right. So, all the stuff's pretty simple. Now, if you have your own designs you want to upload or whatever, you can, as long as you have them saved on your computer so, or your phone or whatever you're doing. So, you go to upload, and then you can drag it in the chair. I already had this image here, so I'm going to add that in. And select. One. You'll get the warnings like if you go outside the print area, it will too. So it's a fun, so if you want to do something like that here. Stuff. Back. Put something on the right sleeve. It'll restrict what you can do because the print area for the sleeves is very small. Very, very, very small. And of course, it's colors. Wait, they actually changed the primary color since I got more than one color. And then once you do all of this, once you've decided what you want to do, you can click in price, calculate the price for you for that one item. And if you want multiple, say like you're doing a bulk order or something like that, or you want to do a couple of different ones, you can add smalls and medium, large, extra large, and you see it calculates it on the fly. Details, it'll tell you how much each particular item, how much it costs to design parts are free, but when you add to the different parts of the shirt, that actually adds a little bit more to the price. So once you're done, you click Add to Cart. And if you're ready to check out, go to 
the shopping cart, by clicking here or here. If you want to check out, click check out. You should know the rest. So, you have any more questions, or if I didn't feel like <coughs> explain anything really good, let me know. Till next time, deuces, people, and support black business. Peace.